Hey Scorpio, welcome back to Distilled Tarot. My name is Shannon. I'll be guiding you through today's reading. This is going to be our daily reading for Tuesday, March 23rd. Let's see what's going on with Scorpio. At the heart of your reading, we have the Page of Cups. The curiosity about... You want to know how someone feels about you. I don't think you quite have a crush on them per se, but you could develop one if you thought they were interested in you. Your challenge is the Four of Wands reversed. Mm, this could be a few things. It talks about um, commit, commitment in relationships. The challenge might be you are going through a divorce or they are going through a divorce or they might be an ex of yours. Bottom of the deck, we have the Two of Cups, so it looks promising. What are my Scorpios focused on? Knight of Wands. You would love to go after this person, but you don't want to do so sight unseen. That's why you're doing this reconnaissance, dare I say. Uh, you want to see if they would be receptive to your advances before you go charging in. In the recent past, we have the world in reverse, the devil in reverse, and the sun. Three major arcana in the recent past says that you've been through some major energies, probably are still lingering in those energies because these are things that don't just appear and then fade away quickly. This make, it would make a lot of sense if you're the one going through a divorce right now, because what I'm getting is that you are um, getting free from something that had been holding you back, getting free from maybe a toxic relationship where you wanted a fresh new start, but this tether that you had was limiting your ability to step into a, an expansive future independently. Show me the energy of the environment. Ace of Wands. This wand that you are inspired to charge toward your person with has been an inspiration from spirit. You're supposed to go toward this person. In the near future, we have the emperor in reverse. I feel like this is the uh, controlling influence that's uh, represented by this, this breakup. The devil, the breakup, the emperor in reverse. It's someone, wow, king of wands here. Um, someone who was 
keeping you from stepping into your power. You're going to overcome that energy in the near future. The, the power they had over you won't be a hindrance. I feel a pretty strong, like, their energy exiting your life. I'm not sure exactly to what extent that'll happen in the near future for you. But I feel like that's the, it's the beginning of that. Being rid of them. Your surprise energy, Queen of Swords in reverse. You got something wrong. You insinuated something that was off base. So you'd have to think about, okay, what situation have I looked at recently and thought, you know what, I know what's really going on there. I'm sure of it. Whatever you, whatever comes to mind when I'm describing that energy, I think you're going to be presented with evidence to the contrary. And I don't have an indication of what that might be here in the spread. If you have tried to tell other people about this what you had believed to be the real truth, um, there may be a bit of eating crow involved. Um, that's an expression for those of you unfamiliar that just describes um, having to go back and admit that you were wrong. Your hopes and fears, we have judgment. Since the topic of divorce has come up, Judgment in that context can mean you want that final resolution to the the court proceedings of a divorce Or the legal proceeding of a divorce I get a strong sense of a, a final resolution So if divorce doesn't resonate for you, what you're craving here, what you're hoping for, is some sort of final resolution. I think it would be connected to the, the world energy um, because we're talking about this opportunity to put the past behind you and have a fresh start, step into sun energy, and that carries a bit of finality along with it, like things aren't going to go back to the way they were before, I'm committed to this new expansive future. The end result, we have the lovers. So. I think happy ending here with your Page of Cups person. Um, I think that they are going to be just as interested in you as you are in them. Um, but there's only one way to find out is charge ahead toward them. Let's see your advice. Six of Wands. Hmm.
For some of you, I'm getting the distinct impression that you're a fan of theirs. You could, um, like if they're a performer or an athlete, you might have the opportunity to go support them in what they do. In which case, this is advocating for that. Continue to support them, cheer them on, celebrate their successes. If they don't know that you're a supporter or a fan, then it might be saying, um, reach out to them and let them know how much you admire them, how much you um, celebrate what they're doing. Now, taking another approach to this advice, we could be saying, charge ahead toward victory. Keep your eye on the prize and stay positive about your expected outcome. If you expect to win, if you expect to succeed, then that's, um, that potential exists for you. Scorpio, I hope that helped. Enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you back tomorrow. Bye.